You guys interested in a level 60 OPQ system? Well, that's what I bring you today. How's it going guys, my name's DPJ and today I bring you another BR3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps me out and subscribe if you do want to see more. So an OPQ system is a weapon which was exclusive to the Revenge of the Cartels event, where you would have it drop from a couple of enemies within this activity, which ended quite a while back. Problem is, back when this event did end, max level was then 57 I do believe. Since then we have had updates which sees levels go up to a level 60, as you know. But this was a weapon which was kinda left in the past at a level 57. But even so, the level 57 version of this is still a beast, if you still use it you would know that. But the level 60 version people is a lot lot better, because it comes with the updated damage scaling applied to it. Now this is a weapon I will state that has been edited on PC and transferred across the console. I say this because I know some people out there get upset when weapons have been modded. What's happened with this is it's just been scaled up to a Mayhem 10 level 60. Nothing else has been added to it so it hasn't been made any more powerful than what it would be if it legitly drop in game at a level 60 on Mayhem 10. It would be just like this. So just so we are clear on that. Now using the weapon instead of their level 57 version on the same builds I can tell you it is incredible. Obviously much better than the level 57 version. Now if you are new to Borderlands and never took part in the Revenge of the Cartels event, the OPQ system is by far in my opinion the best assault rifle in the game. And what's unique about it is not only its second firing mode, where it spawns in another OPQ system which targets enemies, but it is also a 2x variant, but at the same time it doesn't consume 2 ammo per shot, so it makes for this thing being a truly deadly weapon, and it is incredibly powerful. Now this weapon also shoots a deadly blasts of shock damage at the same time, but this here you have to be careful with. The first week I used this I actually had no idea what was going on, but I just kept downing myself. And I later figured out it was because of this weapon and that shock damage. If you're close to an enemy and you shoot it and that shock blast hits the enemy, there's a good chance you're going down, so use it with caution. Or you could pair it with the transformer shield and you'll be absolutely fine using this thing. Now the way you get this is it can be sent to you via PC if your console shift account is linked to a PC shift account. On PC you share items via that shift account. So if your console shift account is the same one you use on a PC account, then things sent to you on PC will also go over to your console. And this is how I get things sent to me. But what I am willing to do is, if you do not have a PC account, is give out this item via my Discord, as I currently have it on Xbox where I am doing plenty of loot lobbies. You join my lobby, I drop you the item, you pick it up and you leave. I'm also on the lookout for someone on PS4 who also has a PC account who know how it works. Who would also like to help me and my community out. At the moment though, I can only guarantee this people on Xbox. But get over there on my Discord for updates on what platforms this can be given out on. Because by the time you watch this video, I've probably already made the hookup with someone playing on PS4. I also have many, many other weapons I will be giving away soon too. Weapons that ain't even been released in the game yet. So stay tuned for updates on those said items. But for now, join my Discord to be able to get your hands on this little beauty. But yeah guys, this is the level 60 OPQ system and how you get your hands on it. It's definitely a weapon worthwhile having in my opinion and I will have a few different variants to give out too. So do what you gotta do people to land this beast. I will leave you now if you are interested to see what this thing is capable of. But on that note, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and wanna see more Borderlands, be sure to subscribe. And if you never wanna miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I'll see you on that next one.